Hello, welcome to the Properties of Victoria Professionals Spring Market Update for the month of May. Today I'm here with Sarah West from the Properties of Victoria Professionals Real Estate Team along with Callum Gregg from Prime Mortgage Works. Sarah's going to talk to us today about the market and the spring market conditions and what buyers and sellers can expect out there in today's real estate world. And Callum will be talking today about uh, buyers and how they are better prepare themselves with their mortgage approval process to put them in the best position going forward when putting offers in. Sarah, how's the market today? <laughs> Thank you, Bill. We are definitely into our spring market. We're starting to see an increase in inventory as well as an increase in number of sales. Our inventory though is still down 40% from where we were last year at this time. And the benchmark house price has increased by about 20% from last year to this year. We are still seeing quite a few multiple offer situations and that is still the norm. There are a few occasions out there though where sellers are pricing houses where they feel it should sell, not necessarily soliciting a multiple offer, but settling into a bit more of a traditional style, which is with subject conditions and not as many people bidding on the property. But again, the norm is certainly the multiple offer situation. So it is very important as a buyer to be prepared in that situation. So we brought in Callum today to just help us let buyers know, Callum, what can buyers do to be best prepared for this type of situation? Yeah, thanks, sir. All, all great points. Uh, you know, it's important to be prepared. And by prepared, I mean, uh, don't just go out there and find out that you're good for it. Uh, like you get on a plane and, and you're wanting a smooth flight, we try to do our best in, in, the, in the same with the mortgage process. And by that, I mean, you know, have your income verification ready to go. Have your taxes up to date and paid personal taxes, I mean, uh, have your down payment ready to go, uh, ready to be submitted to your mortgage lender. And if there's any blips whatsoever on your credit history, uh, past or present or even uh, far ago, uh, get that taken care of before we're getting into the mortgage approval process. That allows us uh, to then uh, have that smooth sale uh, into the mortgage approval uh, and into the property approval once you've got a property under contract. Don't wait to get those things done. Get them done right up front. Thank you, Callum. One of the things we're seeing is some buyers feel they've been given a pre-approval but actually haven't gone through and given their documents as Callum suggested. So make sure as a buyer that you have all of that paperwork in. Thank you very much for joining us in our May market update and have a great day. Thank you.